per the request of some of our viewers, I've decided to re-review the Saddleback Medium Bifold Wallet in Tobacco Brown. Um, this is eight months in. I got it as a Christmas present. Um, and uh, so some people were kind of wondering, you know, what it looks like after you've had it for a while, uh, once it's kind of broken in. Um, so it it does it has gotten quite a bit darker um, as the oils from the leather sort of rise to the surface as it gets used and it kind of collects dirt and uh, sort of breaks in, wears in, starts to look gives it that kind of vintage look um, wallet uh, actually uh, started to fit my cards a lot better now that it's had some time under its belt so to speak um, certain spots have kind of gotten uh, don't mind the dust I work on a construction site and uh, the inside kind of got a little bit dusty there and I gotta clean that up still um, that's not really the wallet's fault that's more me um, so what we're looking at here though is uh, just kind of some spots where you can see um, sort of the, uh, the oil and the rub spots where it kind of rubs in on each other and uh, kind of creates some sort of strange shadows around the cards and stuff like that. Um, I don't think it looks bad though. Uh, the edges still look pretty good to me. Um, I kind of occasionally run something across them, sort of slick them down when they kind of get frayed. I know that's uh, not really the way it comes from the factory, but that's kind of how I like it, so that's the way I do it. It doesn't really take much effort. Um, again, this is the Tobacco Brown, but uh, after eight months of use, it's lightened up quite a bit. Um, it does have... What I found really convenient is that uh, there is a place in here where uh, you can keep business cards and there's plenty of room for a large stack of cards here so um, those are my business cards uh, if you get a chance check out uh, gunhuggerholsters.com anyway uh, I did have one of the questions was uh, that I had from the channel or from our subscribers was uh, whether or not it breaks cards. Um, I haven't had any problems with it breaking my ID or my library card or my uh, FOID card because I live in Illinois. Um, the problem I have had with it is the problem I have had with this particular uh, wallet is that my bank card did happen to uh, break so that's been kind of an issue um, but overall it's been a really nice wallet and I like it the more it gets broken in now I will say that when I'm sitting on it you can definitely tell it's there because somebody asked if I was a front pocket or a back pocket kind of guy you can definitely tell that the wallet is there. It's it's a thick wallet. It's not uh, it's not small really by any means. I think it's a nice convenient size personally. Um, one of the things that I do is when I get it uh, when I get it in my pocket, I try to kind of push it into a spot where it's not going to fold all weird, um, so that when it breaks in, it kind of breaks in evenly. I want the crease kind of, I'm really uh, kind of uh, kind of really attentive when it comes to this kind of stuff, but the, the, way, the way it breaks in, if you're not careful, it'll be all kind of lopsided like that, you know, like, uh, so I try to make sure I push it to where the crease will end up being even. Um, generally, that's all you have to do, and uh, it works fine. But uh, this is what it looks like after eight months, so I'm sure some of you were wondering. Um, 
as far as the breaking a bank card goes, the other wallet that I had was uh, one of the Maxpedition micro wallets. is like a it's kind of like a single folder. That one also broke bank cards. So I don't know if it's really the wallet's fault or if it's just I use bank cards until they break. Um, I think that might be more what it is because they're usually pretty old um, by the time I replace them. So. Uh, Overall, I'm still really happy with the wallet, and uh, I think that uh, if you get a chance to try one out, uh, you will be too. Um, it's got plenty of room for everything that you need to carry, and uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.